if you are trying to create some sort of flexible shape as you see here for a garden edging it's a good idea to use the arc command and use the tangent following that arc let me demonstrate so I'll select draw arc and I'll say arc tangent and what it does is pick up the last arc that I drew which is um, as you can see it's attached itself to it and you can see the center point of the arc is showing as that cross in the center that's moving up and down as I do so if I come into here I can close I begin closing that shape so that that arc there is tangential to this one which is tangential to that arc and this arc as we move around the corner when you get to a, an area where the, the slope changes dramatically try and put small arcs in still use the arc and tangential too and do it in that way the reason I suggest doing that is that if you want to give information to your construction team those arcs all have a center point and you can just swing a circle from that center point so you can plot the X and Y coordinates at the center point of all of those arcs you could do that by using your object snap and uh, pick the center option then you could draw for a block or a point at say the center point of this arc there we could come along to the next arc and find it there's its center point the repeat that command come along to the next arc and repeat the command again and it's the same arc isn't it that's a really big one through there let's find that arc there so these points here represent the center points of the arc so if I click on this one here there's the center point of that arc if I click on this one over here the center point of the circle from which that arc is drawn is now accurately plotted and you can use information and uh, location data and pick up that point there and print if you want the X and Y coordinates if you make some point in the design a set off or a base point might be the core the intersection of two fence lines then any construction team can swing an arc from uh, from that given the X and Y distance they knock a peg in here they know the radius of the arc you can tell them that uh, by dimensioning the arc and uh, in other words you can give the the construction team enough information to be able to accurately plot what is a complex shape.